Hey everybody, Ron Bielefeld, Whistling Wings Photography. Welcome to another video. In this video, exciting news. I've got a new product to go along with my speed shooter harness system. It's the speed shooter belt. For those of you who don't already know about my speed shooter harness system, this is it. This is the full system. It's a harness that allows you to shoot handheld, even with your heaviest camera systems, 600 F4 for example, Canon R5 with a battery grip. It allows you basically to shoot with no weight on your hands and arms, have the ultimate inability to shoot low, standing up, move around whenever you want without having to do any adjustments once you get it adjusted correctly. The harness is designed to give you the ultimate support for heavy systems, even for lighter systems, especially if you're shooting things like video. By providing weight distribution to your shoulders and taking it off your hands and arms. If you get the optional waist belt built into the harness system, you can then adjust the weight so that it is distributed between your shoulders and your waist, all on your shoulders or all on your waist, anywhere in between. Now comes the speed shooter belt. It's for those people who do not need the full support of a full harness system. The other great thing about the harness system is that it has a chest strap which adds a safety mechanism plus added support and stability to bigger lenses. If you don't need that, hey, you've got the speed shooter belt to consider. The belt is just what it says. It is, it's just a simple belt with the speed shooter pouch built into it. It can hold just as much weight as the full harness system can. And it's just that simple. So now you can see the versatility of the speed shooter system, whether it's the harness or the waist belt. You can go low, you can stand up, you could sit down, you can move anywhere, anytime. As quickly as you need to, you can do it. Because once you have the system adjusted, it incorporates a monopod, a Wimberly mono gimbal head, and then of course your camera system. Once you have it adjusted to your height, you're ready to go. You can kneel, you can sit, you can move in an instant, getting the shot more often without as you can see, I'm holding my system up with one finger without all the weight on your hands and arms. So you can shoot all day long. You can shoot with your hand underneath the lens like you normally would if you were hand holding, but now you also have the option to shoot over the top, all in a simple belt system, which distributes the weight, of course, on your waist. Now, you'll say, well, what about just getting a pouch and putting it on my belt that's on my pants or my shorts. Sure, you could do that. One big problem with that is that tends to put weight and drag something down that you probably don't want dragged down. We don't need to go into any more details, I don't think. That's the problem with that system. This has an integrated belt and when the belt is adjusted to the right tension on your waist, it basically hooks on your pelvis. So it is not putting pressure on whatever you're wearing, pulling it downward with all this weight, right? It's not gonna happen. So I think it's a much better solution than just attaching a pouch to the belt that you already have on. Now, the other great thing about this is that you can get integrated Molly attachments, so you can put accessory pouches on here just like you can on the harness system for storage of extra batteries, teleconverters, extra media cards, whatever you need. You can also get a back pad. You can get a back pad for the harness here as well. If you have the belt uh, option on the harness, you can also get pads for the shoulder straps if you get the full harness. But if you're using the uh, new waist belt, then you can get one for your back, adds a little bit of comfort the system. It's simple. Just like in the speed shooter harness, the pouch is designed to hold the foot 
of your monopod fairly securely so that it just doesn't come right out, which is a great security thing when you're moving around getting the shot that you're trying to get. You don't want to be concerned about the foot of your monopod coming out of the pouch. It won't come out until you take it out. And that's, I think, a big uh, added advantage of the speed shooter belt. Getting it back in, just that simple. <laughs> simple, right? Yeah, simple. It is simple. So anyway, that is the new speed shooter belt. If you want more information, or hey, if you want to order one, or if you want to order a harness, go to my website, www.whistlingwingsphotography.com. Go up to my store, click on Speed Shooter Harness, and you can find all the information you'd ever want on the system. Bunches of videos there with uh, more information. So check it out. Hey, until next time, I hope you have great light. Hope you're getting great images. Be safe out there. I'll see you soon.